Hello and welcome to a quick video um, on the overview of Dragon Naturally Speaking. Um, Dragon Naturally Speaking is a voice recognition software and arguably the best in the world. Um, Dragon isn't only designed for people with cognitive impairments, um, it's also used to boost productivity. Another is to reduce the strain when using a keyboard, the strain put on your hands, eyes, shoulders, etc. Or maybe like me, you like the idea of being able to lean back in your chair, putting your feet up and still get work done. So this video is only going to be around five minutes or so and is designed to give you a quick insight in what Dragon is capable of. Um, I'm going to quickly cover opening Dragon, activating the microphone, uh, things including like muting the microphone, basic commands. Um, I'm also going to quickly navigate a website within Internet Explorer to show you how that works. And then I'll finish off the video by opening a Word document, um, dictating into it, um, uh, spell it making spelling changes, etc. with, with Dragon. Um, so I'm currently running Dragon Naturally Speaking 11 um, on Windows 7. So if you're using any different kinds of software, uh, maybe a uh, later version of, of, of Dragon or a newer version of Windows, things might look a bit different, um, but the basic premise and how it interacts with the, the operating system um, and programs should be the same. So let's begin by opening Dragon. Here we are. So Dragon uses things called profiles. Um, these are tailored around you completely. Um, they are set up with a specific microphone in mind, a specific voice in mind, um, and the more you use Dragon, the better it will be at picking up your voice. Um, I'm not going to show you the setup of the profile today because of the limited time scale, um, but here is mine. You can set several with different different microphones in different environments, etc. But here is my one, so I'll open that and that will load. I have to give it a minute, it does take a bit of time. Okay, so while I'm here, um, this is the Dragon toolbar on this thing at the top. This will always stay on top of it, uh, on top of the operating system and all your windows. Um, so this here is the microphone status. Uh, red, red is off, amber is for not listening. Um, well, I say not listening. It's not listening to any commands apart from wake up or start listening, which will resume microphone. And green is means it's listening. Um, other information is here. As you can see, it says Dick Dragon's microphone is off. You can press its hotkey or click its icon to turn it on. And there's some settings and things over here to customize Dragon. Okay, so let's go ahead by clicking the red microphone up here. And that will turn it on. Stop listening. Okay. Uh, throughout the video, I will probably be saying stop listening and start listening quite a lot. Um, just because I don't want Dragon um, when it's on green, which it means it's ready to take commands and or dictate to get confused while I'm talking to you exactly what I'm going through. So if I keep saying stop listening or, or start listening, that, that's why. Okay, so now let's open up Internet Explorer and um, and go from there. Wake up. Open Internet Explorer. Stop listening. There we go. So you can see um, Internet Explorer has opened and it's taken me to the BBC website. Dragon works on a visual basis. So if you see a link you'd like to navigate to, you simply say click followed by the link you'd like to go to. Um, for example, wake up, click TV, stop listening. So Dragon has clicked on the link and has taken us to that page. Um, so now I want to search in that page. So this is done by the following. Wake up. Click search. Football. Press enter. Stop listening. 
So okay, so what we've done there is we've navigated into the search bar, and we've dictated to it that we want to search for football, um, and then we've told Dragon that to push enter on the keyboard, and now it's searched for um, football-related content within the TV section. Okay, so now I want to close down Internet Explorer, and I want to open up a Word document. Wake up. Click close. Open Microsoft Word. Stop listening. Okay, so we've closed Internet Explorer and now we're just opening Microsoft Word by the simple open command. Um, so I'm going to quickly show you how to dictate into the document. Um, so when dictating, it's best to speak clearly and at a normal pace, um, including any punctuation you may want in there. Um, Dragon b works best when you talk how you would normally, um, at a constant pace. Um, wake up. Hello, comma, my name is Alistair. Stop listening. Okay, um, it's spelt my name correctly, normally uh, Word documents don't. If there was a spelling mistake, um, you do the following. So wake up, select Alistair, stop listening. Okay, here, so say if my name was wrong, um, or there was a word that it came up with a spelling error, you'd say select and then the word. So in this bit, after select Alistair, it's come up with a bunch of options it thinks you might mean instead. So for example, if it was the top one, I would do the following. Wake up, choose one, stop listening. And as you can see, it's changed it for me, and I can carry on dictating. Um, there's a n number, a bunch of other things you can do. You can you can underline things. Um, wake up. Underline Alistair. Stop listening. And that's the same throughout the board. You know, you you can say uh, bold Alistair or bold that before a sentence. Um, same with cap cap capital letters, etc. So what we're going to do now is going to quickly save it, close the document, and then that will be the um, end of the video. Wake up. Save document as. Stop listening. Okay, so by saying save document as, we can quickly save the document where we want, and we can navigate through the window to where we want to save it, change the file name, and then... If everything's okay, we can click save. Wake up, click save. Click close. Stop listening. And there we have it. That is a quick introduction to Dragon, naturally speaking, and a few of the things you can do with it.